I just read this Bloomberg article and it legit it just said uh <laughs> Sony's in a yikes moment with PlayStation VR two. Which I mean it I like PlayStation VR one didn't do that well. But Sony is expecting PlayStation VR two to do at least as good as PlayStation VR one. Which isn't like a like a bad thing to think. When you think like, oh, PlayStation VR one only sold like five million units or some crazy shit like that. Out of a hundred million consoles you sold, only five percent of people adapted to VR. And they made a second headset. Cost more than the console does. And it's been a month it's been out for like a month, I think. And they only sold like 200,000 headsets or some shit like that. That's the article said. They only sold like 200 some thousand headsets, but they they produced 2 million to launch. They launched with 2 million headsets. They haven't even sold a quarter of the I mean they sold a quarter of 1 million, <laughs> which is crazy and Sony is still pushing fucking metaverse. That was crazy when I read that that they're pushing for metaverse like like literally Facebook aka meta platform aka the meta quest which is selling out everywhere why is sony going to the fucking vr why why is sony pushing vr why ain't they i don't understand bro i don't understand but i mean sony really wants vr they want vr real fucking bad that's why they're pushing vr so hard but i mean if five percent of your fan base adapted to it the first time and the second time is not going any better. When does Sony call it quits with VR, bro? When does Sony call it quits with VR? This is a Bloomberg article, by the way. So, like, I mean, this is not just some random ass place. This is Bloomberg. They're, hey, they're, they're investigating as best as they can. And this shit is looking bad for VR. I mean, VR isn't one of those things that I, like, I adapted to myself. I don't fuck with VR at all. And that's why I'm not really surprised that a lot of people not fucking with vr either because vr is one of those gimmicky ass things right now vr isn't intricate it isn't advanced enough for you to feel like you're you're full dive in the game it's not like that all the games are gimmicky as hell all the games are are literally like point and click they're like point and click games just on your face it's like it's like they're not that immersive they're not that visually pleasing not a lot of them. I know Sony tried to make like some some walking simulator showpieces to sell the fucking uh PlayStation VR too, but shit it doesn't work. And I mean, in the contrast to that, it's kind of wild because remember, people hated the Connect Two that came with the Xbox One. They hated Connect Two, but Connect One did so well. Connect One did so well, so like twenty something million units of Connect One that they had to make Connect Two. They, they would be stupid not to make Connect 2 and it didn't work out the second time. I don't know why Sony thinks the opposite is going to happen when you fail with PlayStation VR 1. You make a more expensive PlayStation VR 2 and think it's going to do better, bro. It doesn't make sense, Sony. It doesn't make sense, but they're trying. They're really trying. And I mean, they really want to go to the metaverse, but like the metaverse isn't even, isn't even working right now. <laughs> I don't even think Meta is going to the metaverse right now, but Sony's really fucking trying for it. And I mean, I don't I don't hope they fail, but like it's not looking good for them. So let me know what y'all think down below. Is PlayStation VR 2 even worth it at this point? Nobody's buying it. Worldwide, it's it's not even sold 300,000 units yet. And they started with 2 million, supposedly. I think there was a story that came out that said Sony only so only like shipped one million because they was gonna make two million initially, but then they thought about it like let's just make one million and see what happens. They haven't even sold a quarter of that yet. It's kind of crazy. Let me know what y'all think down below, and I'll see y'all in the next video.